This is not paving baraka for that person day. Among some of the most vulnerable people are widows. Most of them cannot afford three meals a day and sometimes cannot afford to buy decent cloth before, during and after Eid prayers. Therefore, to lessen the burden of buying Eid dresses this year, the Know Your Quran Foundation has provided dresses to 300 widows for this year's Idul Adha prayers. Don't die, don't pass, I won't see you. I lost my husband several years ago and I've been suffering ever since with my children. I thank the foundation for considering widows, especially during these trying times in the country. I am really happy about these dresses the foundation has provided to us. I have been a widow for several years and it has not been very easy for me and my family since my husband's death. I thank God and appreciate this organization for giving this dress to us for Idul Adha. I was already thinking of what to wear during this coming Eid. Helping widows is among the major projects of the Know Your Quran Foundation. The foundation provides clothing, meat, and also organizes prayer sessions for widows and their late husbands every year. Widows, they are deprived people, you know. We embarked on this project because orphans are always considered when it comes to support, forgetting that widows are also deprived people who need support from society. And therefore, if we support widows, they will be strong to support their children. So we are appealing to people to support widows as they also need help. Out there, inshallah. They are going to keep close to this, to this organization and know your one foundation. The foundation has also called on other organizations and philanthropists to come to the aid of widows because some of them have been faced with lots of challenges. For SLBC News are in Freetown, Fatima Kamara reporting.